Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm making this super stunning gold leaf clear bar of soap. It is a super simple DIY that anyone can do and it adds such a touch of class to any bathroom. So if you want to know how I made this soap, then keep on watching. I started off by chopping up enough glycerin soap for one bar. I then put it into my container for melting. After I melted down all my soap, I made sure that there were no clumps left and it was all smooth. Then it was time to add my fragrance oil. I purposely picked out a fragrance oil that was clear in color, because when I add it to my soap, I want it to retain its clarity. Some fragrance oils can have a tint to them, depending on what chemicals were used to make them. I wanted to make sure that everything else was nice and clear, so you could really see the gold flakes. A good rule of thumb is 1 to 2 milliliters of fragrance oil per bar of soap. Assuming your soap bar is about of average weight, not super small or super large. After the fragrance oil is all mixed in, it's time to add the gold leaf. There's a lot of different suppliers of gold leaf on Amazon, that's where I got mine. It's not as expensive as you might think, and there are lots of different options. You can even get silver leaf if you want. Just make sure that it's of the thin, edible variety. This will make sure that it's really thin and can break up in the soap easily. This will also ensure that when you're using the bar of soap once it's finished, the gold leaf won't scratch you. It'll be really soft and dissolve away in the water. Gold leaf sticks to basically the first thing it touches, so be really careful. If you're trying this at home, make sure to turn off any fans that may be blowing around, as the gold leaf is really delicate and can blow away. I slowly added in four sheets of gold leaf until I liked how much gold leaf there was in the soap. You can add more or less depending on your taste. I also personally liked the varieties and sizes of the gold leaf, so I kept some chunks big while breaking up others into smaller chunks. After I was happy with how my mixture looked, I went ahead and poured into my mold. I then just used my spatula to maneuver around the gold leaf so it was evenly distributed. I then used my rubbing alcohol to pop any bubbles on top to give it a nice finished look. And after it sets up, you can unmold and use it right away. This is how mine came out. I think it is super cute. You can really see the gold flakes. I love how this turned out and I hope you guys try it because it's super fun and you get such stunning results with it. Thank you guys so much for watching, I hoped you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like this video and subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you guys on the next one.